So I'm here to show you three different kinds of exfoliation and masks that I've learned from um, well, my mom, my grandmother and just women in India who use natural products. Alright, so we're gonna do a lip scrub. As you can tell, my lips are one of my more prominent features. You take a little sea salt, depending on the size of your lips, <laughs> you can decide how much to put. 100% pure vegetable glycerin. And then a little bit of rose water so it's gentle on your mouth. So this is a body scrub. It's an exfoliator, hydrator, it moisturizes, it heals. But please try it on your hand to see if you're allergic or not. One cup of gram flour. Okay, that should be one cup. <laughs> then, yogurt. Not flavored, plain. Depends on the proportions, like that much. And mix it into a paste. A little bit of lemon. If your paste is as bad as mine, which mine is, you add a little milk to it. That's what that looks like. Now, magic ingredients. Some sandalwood powder in there. My best and most favorite ingredient, which works for everything, is turmeric. It gives it love. It might give you a little bit of a yellowish hue, so be careful about how much you put in. And you put it on, on your entire body and just hang out a little bit, let it dry. <laughs> and if you have oily skin, then maybe use like skim milk and like low-fat yogurt or no-fat yogurt. I think it's almost dry, so the idea of it is to scrub it off like that, you see? So it literally like exfoliates. And then you shower and you get rid of whatever excess is on your hand and you see a difference. Now this is a scalp treatment, um, it is usually for like if you have a dry scalp, if you have dandruff. So you start with full fat yogurt, the yogurt helps hydrate the scalp and cool it down. I'm getting hungry. <laughs> a teaspoon of honey, my secret ingredient. It's an egg, apparently they're really good for your hair. I know. You keep it for 30 minutes and you wash it off with like baby shampoo or, or just like warm water. That's what the consistency should look like. Wow, that was a lot of teaching. I don't think I've taught so much in a really long time. And I hope this works for you guys because it really does work for me. This has been taught to us by our mums and our grandmums and these are little secrets that uh, 